Alright folks, it's me, Francis. It's our new Let's Play series. We're gonna play a little bit of StarCraft, Wings of the Liberty, StarCraft 2. Um, well, I'm gonna play a 1 versus 1 map. I have the option of 2 versus 2, 3 versus 3. But I think it's unfair because I'm so much better at the game than most people I get paired with. It's, it's just frustrating overall. So I'm just gonna go ahead and play 1 versus 1. That way I can stick to myself. You got three different races here. I'm gonna show you. Number one is the Terrans. They're the stupid humans. Pretty much, you know, they're pretty much like you and me, you know, um, pretty bloodthirsty, uh, a lot of technology, because we're weak shells. You got the Zerglings, these guys are clearly based on the Aliens franchise, you can see by their faces and mouth, clearly that's from the Aliens franchise. And, uh, if you need further proof that this game is based on the Aliens franchise, you have the Predator here. Uh, the Predator quite clearly is, uh... Uh, Protoss there, they're they're based on the, the Predator technology. So you got aliens versus Predators versus humans, which is pretty much been done to death, but that's what they're doing here. And it's fun to do. And I'm going to show you how it's done. So I'm going to play vers one versus one. I'm going to play the Protoss here. And uh, we're just going to have the game matches. And uh, we're just going to kick some butt here. I'm going to show you uh, my build order. I think you're going to find it very useful. It's a build order that you could use, a build order that you could perform. Anybody could perform. And uh, it'll help you become uh, pretty good at the game. I, it's an expert build because I am an expert at the game. Uh, but I, I think it's one that anybody should be able to do. Oh, here we go. We got a player found. Hooray. Serious fun times begin now. And, uh, and I haven't played the game in a couple of months. I just reinstalled. I had to download a bunch of stuff. Uh, let's see. Uh, Boogie here playing the Protoss. And I'm loading there. And this guy's Rice. See, uh, his computer is really slow. Look at how slow he's loading the map. What a what a wimp. He probably even doesn't even have it on Ultra settings either. <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, so I'm going to have to kill this guy, Rice. Um, who's apparently... Is playing, I think that means Terran. It's been a while, I think they changed those. So you want to get your guys making some minerals. Very important to get some minerals going. And you want to get your base cranking out more of your little robots. These are your collector units, the probes. You can see they're collecting the different uh, crystals here. on um, Minerals that you need to build pretty much everything in the game. Very important. Now, we're on a large map here, so it may be a little while till we make contact with anybody. Uh, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go ahead and uh, I'm going to take my probe who's working hard. And he's going to start making me some pylons. Now, pylons power your buildings. They power your units. They power everything. It's pretty much the most important item in the game. And I think they're very important. And you probably do, too. Well, we're going to start our... First base warping in here. Let's get in here so we can start making uh, zealots. Very important. Zealots are very important to the game. And we're going to get another pylon going on here. So that we can have plenty of energy, plenty of minerals, plenty of everything you need. And as you can see, the crystals that you're mining here go directly into making a pylon. You can really pile on top of them if you want. And uh, now as soon as we get, as soon as we get the energy and the building built, we're going to start cranking out some zealots. They're going to crank us out a few zealots. Best unit in the early game for sure. Uh, Marines got nothing on them. Marines can do nothing on them. And here we go, here we go. Now I'll show you a little trick. A lot of people don't know to do this, but look. Chrono boost. Yeah, we're going to make that sucker pump them out even faster. Even faster, yeah. And uh, now we're gonna get us a cybernetic core coming in. And what this does is it creates a ranged unit. Because as you can see, the Z lot here, he is exclusively, exclusively melee. Now here comes an SGV. Now what's happening here is our opponent is scouting us out. He's scouting us out, looking to see what he can find. And I think what he found, he does not like. Yeah, he's running away from that zealot, as he damn well should be, because zealots are the best units in the game, the best damn unit. You can't ask for a better unit. Now, what we're going to have to start doing now is start assimilating some gas. 
Now, gas is an important part of the game. In order to have any technologies, you gotta have gas. Oh, there comes that SCV. There he comes, trying to see what's going on. Trying to see what he can do and what he can get. I'll tell you what he can get. He's getting dead. Is what he's gonna get. Look at that. Look at those Z-Lots doing their job. That's right. Good luck, buddy. That's right. That's one dead SCV. And now we're cranking out a lot of goodies, a lot of guys. And uh, once we have, once we have a few stalkers coming in, I don't think there's, I don't think there's going to be anything a Terran unit is going to be able to do. Once I have three or four stalkers, I'm pretty sure I've got this wrapped up. Uh, all right, now it looks like our current army is about as good as it's going to get. So we're going to take our little army. We're going to explore a little bit. We're going to go down here and see if we can figure out exactly where our Terran opponent's living. And see how much he's paying for rent. Because I think he's paying too much. So what we're going to do is go to the center of the map here. Yeah, the here in the center of the map, we'll be able to see pretty much everything that's going on in the center. So we'll be able to do pretty much whatever it takes to finish him off. Oh, looks like he's spying on us. Look at this. Looks like he's spying on us. Like a dirty son of a gun. And I don't think he likes what he sees. So we're just going to pay him a visit. Oh, look here now. He knows I'm coming. Because he clearly has protected his base. Oh, here we go. Now we're going to get into the thick of things here. And we should have this wrapped up pretty easily. Should be very simple. Oh, God damn it! God damn it! I didn't see the tank! I didn't know there was a tank there! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I can't believe there's a tank there. All right, well, that's fine. I'm just going to give you some void rays coming in. Ah, more Vespin gas. I need more Vespin gas. That's all you ever need in this stupid game. Require more Vespin gas. I freaking hate Vespin gas. But that's fine. That's fine. We're going to be fine. It's not a problem. It's not a problem. We're going to be fine. I am the voice of the Eclipse. For the reckoning. Very well. Oh, looks like he's coming for me. Looks like he's ready to fight. And uh, if he's ready to fight, let me tell you something. You know that I'm ready to fight. I got my units all organized and ready to fight. And it's just going to be a short matter of time before I'm wrecking him. I'm just going to wreck him. I think he's coming to see what he can get. And I'll tell you what he can get. He can get nothing from me. He ain't getting shit from me. That's what he's getting. Getting a big face full of void rays, that's what he's gonna get. Gonna get a shit ton of void rays. Looks like he's spying us, he's preparing. He's preparing for the battle. He's using his spy abilities. And here we go, we easily got this. Look at this, we easily got this. Not a problem. All his tanks and oh my god, god damn it! God damn it! Where are my z -lots? Look at this son of a bitch! Look at this son of a bitch! What are you doing? Why is he doing this? How did he have so many goddamn units? I don't understand! I don't understand this is bullshit! How did he have so many units? How does he have so many goddamn units? How do you have so many units? Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I bet you can't even take my base. I bet you can't even take my base. Oh my god, this son of a bitch. Oh my god. 
I'm gonna get him the heal. I should be able to finish his army off. They should be able to finish his army off. God damn it! How many tanks does he have? How do you have so many tanks? You son of a bitch! Oh my god. Oh my god. I hate this game. I hate it.